Hey everyone, so when you're playing Sea of Thieves, you uh, want to do some emissaries, but uh, you're a little bit concerned on maybe too many reapers or someone doing the same emissary as you. Uh, but you don't want to be obviously just going around the seas with your spyglass trying to figure out who is doing what. Well, in today's video, I'm going to show you a very quick and easy method to find out who's doing what emissaries on your server when you first log into the game so here we are at plunder outpost and all you have to do is go to each emissary board now you may have just bypassed this you may already know this if you don't then this is going to be a helpful video if you do then leave me a comment in the comment section saying that you already know this trick so we've gone over to the athena board and as you can see here on the athena board this is where you would normally vote i have the hood off for the purpose of the video and we have a little tiny boat here that means there is at least one ship on the server that is doing the Athena's emissary. You can do this for each and every single one of them. So we're going to head over to the gold hoarders now. And we have no one on gold hoarders. Same with the order of the souls. We have no order of the souls. And then we're going to go along to the beach. Just around the corner. We have two reaper's bones on the servers at the moment. And finally, we'll go to the merchants just to show that it works on any of the emissaries. And we have no one doing the merchants. So on this server currently, we have two Reapers and we have one Athena. No one's doing any of the original ones. Uh, so yeah, that's all you have to do is just when you first start your game, have a look at the boards where you would vote for the emissary. And it will have a little ship on there if anyone is actually doing said emissary saves you having to ride around looking through your spyglass checking out people's flags and trying to work it out so there you go there is my very quick tip video or guide on how to just check how many emissaries are on your server at one time right when you load into the game like i say i do this every time i start a game i quickly check see uh, who's doing what so obviously if there's too many reapers on the server you don't really want to be doing athena you're more likely to get attacked for the flag they're going to get a lot of points for that uh, obviously any other emissary if they're at level five they can see you on the map as well so i just choose what emissary i'm going to do uh that other people ain't doing so if everyone was doing gold orders uh order of the souls athena and there was a reaper on i would probably and there was no merchant i'd probably go and do a merchant for example you don't have to do that you can just risk it all and go for it but uh, what i tend to find is that sometimes you get a few ships that if you're on the same emissary they obviously know that you're gathering certain types of uh, rewards so whether it be crates or chests or schools and they will try and take them to aid their profits further but there you go hopefully that video has helped if it has then uh, leave a comment if you knew about this uh, leave a comment if you didn't so as you know i am back doing sea of thieves content i will be back doing showcases once i get enough gold to actually get some of the new uh, cosmetics uh, I will be doing guides and news as well like I used to do in the past and hopefully you're enjoying my return to the Sea of Thieves content. Thanks everyone for watching, have a great rest of your day and take care.